Welcome back to Sotoku Tech. I hope you've been having fun following along as I play with this TTGO TWOX 2020, though I do get a sense that some of you are frustrated and just wanted to tell you the time. So this is going to be a short video about an example sketch called RTC, which lets us manually set the time hard-coded in the sketch. The only catch here is you have to set that time ahead a little bit to allow time to compile your sketch. So you run a trial run, edit the file in Notepad, save it, open in the Arduino IDE, compile it, and time that. Then set the time for that amount of time it took to compile it, save the file, open it in our Arduino IDE, and upload it. So you'll see that's what we're doing here. I set it for four minutes ahead because I calculated three minutes to compile and upload. And then I waited for the top of the minute and had my mouse cursor ready to click on the upload button. And we'll crop out some of the progress indicator here. The only problem with this RTC sketch is if you power the watch off and power it back on again, it will set itself to the time that was hard-coded at the time you uploaded the sketch. So you want to use the RTC sketch to set the time on your watch and then upload other sketches. This sets us up for my next video where I'll be using Platform.io to upload another watch binary. And as my friend Carson Wells here has requested, he wants a Fred Flintstone sundial watch. So let's see if we can do that. So anyway, as you can see here, my watch winds up just 12 seconds ahead of my computer clock. So I got it pretty close. All right, stay tuned. Thank you very much. Give this video a like. Click down below for the links in the description. Click up here to subscribe. And click over here to check out the TTGO playlist. Thank you very much.